How's it going? It's that time of year when I need to go through my drawers, maybe give some stuff away, throw some stuff away, mm -hmm. move some stuff from the roof boxes downstairs and then move some of the stuff that I'm not going to be using during the winter upstairs. I have an upstairs and a downstairs. But first, coffee. Kind of a hot day today combined with very windy this looks like the perfect project to kind of tackle right now because it's super windy outside some of the shirts that i have here in the closet like these ones i don't really wear during the winter because they're too thin and i can't really put something on top of them so these are gonna have to go somewhere else where i can make space for other stuff for the winter like sweaters and stuff now that i have a lot of sweaters in this drawer here Beach towel has to go. Get my beanie out. This drawer, this is supposed to be my fruit and vegetable drawer and <laughs> there's food in there, but there's a lot of other things as well. I don't think I've mentioned this in the past. These are my containers from the hummus so I don't have I don't have a trash can instead I use these things so it's a double purpose I also use my almonds uh, my almonds bag because it's sealable and stuff like that especially if it's like liquids and I also use these coffee cups as well for trash and that way I repurpose it <laughs> I try to repurpose almost every bag. So I used to have a trash can in here, but I don't see the need anymore since it's hard to buy food that's not bagged. Wipes, they don't belong in here. I do have two avocados <laughs> that belong in here. Oh, there's a lot of ants in here. Holy shit, that's a lot of ants. That was a lot of ants. I'm so glad I'm doing this. I haven't, I threw away all those containers. Maybe they were coming to that. One of them was probably broken or something. So yeah, definitely need to do this cleaning. And I hope that's the worst that I come across. <laughs> okay, this looks a lot better. Much cleaner. This drawer right here is my coffee slash wine drawer <laughs> and got a bit of tea bags back there honey a uh, whole lot of strainers <laughs> this is uh, something that I probably don't use and I should probably throw away what I really want to do here is like really look at what I'm using if I don't use it either throw it away or give it away or something like that. Basically have more space to move around. I wanna get past those days when I have to move a bunch of things to get to something that I need and it's just frustrating. This is uh, kind of the goal here today as well. All right, got my French press here, my tea kettle here, coffee cup that I use once in a while, not often, but I use it. This strainer I actually use to clean up this uh, French press. I got tea, I got honey right here for tea, a whole bunch of tea underneath. This is just another water container that I have. And of course, 
my coffee. In this drawer here, I have my socks slash underwear and it's almost kind of a medicine cabinet. Right now is laundry day, so. <laughs> I was avoiding to show you this, but it is it is what it is. It's uh, full of clothes, so I need to definitely go do laundry. In here I have some of the stuff that I don't use anymore, so this I definitely don't use anymore. I have another one of these that I don't know why I keep it, it's used. This one's new. I also have my trimming kit, which I do use quite a bit. Uh, some extra masks, which I need to go through to see because some of them are too small for me. This is, uh, so I use Harry's for, and it's not sponsored, but I do use Harry's for my blades and my, uh, when I shave. And then they sent me this as a kit shaving gel and this is my travel if I were to fly kind of a body wash which I guess I should keep it but I'm not planning to travel anywhere anytime soon these are the cotton swabs that I have I should have bought a smaller one this has like 600 in there so you know with van life that's one of the things that should be considered buy in small quantities so you can fit it everywhere because right now I have 600 cotton swabs and I had it for a while got some thick socks for winter which are gonna be used they're definitely needed and these are my emergency laundry socks yeah I might as well show you this drawer here which I'm actually not gonna modify because these are all my containers for food storage I did give a bunch of it away and uh, I just kept whatever I need. I have my bowls here, my one pot, which in the winter I make soups and stuff like that. And then underneath it, I have a pan. They're both stainless steel. And I also have the lids for them here, which I use quite a bit. All right, let's see what we got in here. This is my everyday cooking pan because it's non-stick, but it's uh, ceramic and it can only, I can only fit it in here because it's too big. But when I cook in here on the one single burner, then I can cook multiple things at once. See what I mean? I got my microphone here, some rice, some apple cider vinegar. This looks okay. And the craziest thing is I put the microphone in here because it keeps things from rattling and then now I just keep it there. But you know, I can only put some things away in certain areas where they should fit. But other than that, I have a lot of stuff that I should be keeping somewhere else, <laughs> which I don't have the space for. Speaking of a big pan, I'm actually gonna make myself something to eat. avocado toast I've ever made but it's actually pretty good I didn't even mix the avocado I just put like spices on top of it and stuff and if it has to be fast it has to be fast it's official the van is a mess but at least I got my laundry here from there and I'm definitely gonna go do some laundry you gotta put the towel away upstairs or in the back of the van and all of this stuff needs to go back underneath the bed. Check out mystery drawer number three, which is really hard to get to. Broke some sweat to get to that drawer, man. <laughs> Here it is. My ramen. And other dry goods. I have here that I need to be using. 
right here is my ducting for my diesel heater which I'm gonna be using pretty soon it's stuck all the way back there This is my Ryobi box. I uh, seen them on sale at Home Depot at some point and I bought a bunch of them and now I have a lot, which is great. This was definitely a much needed cleaning. It is windy outside. crazy. I found some ants in a drawer eating at something. That was crazy. I'm so glad I caught that and I cleaned it up and I feel a lot cleaner. It's a small space so it's easy to get dirty but it's also easy to clean it up and I do this on a regular basis but not like you know sort out all the drawers and stuff like that. I only do that a few times a year with the seasons changing in case uh, some of the stuff that I don't use anymore especially during the winter I'll put away like my shirts. I only wear t-shirts during the winter. Check out this video up here if you want to see more van life related content. Thank you for sticking around and watching and I will see you in the next one.